Has anyone else noticed that a lot of the female characters in this game have that pose with their hand on their hips? The sassy? Yep. Yeah. I mean, well, alternatively, the they could be not be sassy, and would you like that? No, the, no. The prob <laughs> no. <laughs> the problem is they sassy. can't do, like, arms crossed in front, because that looks real weird if yeah. you don't, like, animate it well. Also, oh, right, Blizzard tried, the, pose, Blizzard tried right? the exact yeah. same pose, but backwards, and that didn't go over so well. <laughs> I forgot Fred's face is a, a bizarre shithole. <laughs> I'm only partially oh, responsible. My pagoda of shit. <laughs> my shit pagoda. Of shit. Alright. Place an amplifier on open platform. How do I do that? Oh, oh I know I know what to do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come over here, bird. Come over to me. Where are you? I mean Come you in. can see my my name, dude. Yeah. Couldn't be that too hard. Uh, using Whee! my own eyes. Alright, what is this? Okay, uh, this is the amplifier. Here. This thing. So there's the thing we're the defending? Hell? Yeah. Oh. Oh, it has been placed. Uh, you know what? Maybe. It's okay. He has to activate it first. Don't activate it immediately. Uh, guys, you want to help me make the, like, largest gazebo over this thing? <laughs> The large okay. Zebo. Yeah, we gotta make a large Zebo. So I'm gonna put metal walls around the actual amplifier just in case, like, shit goes bad. Yeah. We're just gonna go with, like, the basic ones and make I them think... or something. Uh. Gazebo kinda sounds like a Pokemon. So what would be the upgraded? What would be the evolved version of Gazebo? Gazodo. Gazodo. <laughs> Gazuntite. Bungalow. <laughs> Gazongo. Ah, a bungalow. <laughs> Pair of tits, just big ones. No, hey. Oh, oh, I didn't even think of that, but. Kazango. Good work. Good work. Okay. Yeah, actually, Bird, if you wanna. I guess if you guys uh, can't help too much with this, because. Well, I don't know what you have I in don't, mind. Yeah, so. I, I yeah, don't know how to if you put guys... it down. Uh, if you guys want to go find, uh, the two other amplifier spots, you're gonna have to build them eventually anyway. Uh, so now would not be a okay. bad time to make them. I yeah, don't know if it'll let me just, uh, sequence break like that, though. It does. Believe in yourself, I, bird. You have a, you have a sky scissor lift. But I'm scared. I should put a bounce pad on the top of that scissor lift. I have one more floor launcher, and I could put it on the very top of the scissor lift as just being like a suicide platform. I didn't know you could do this. Very strange. Didn't know you could do what? Ah! Uh, a there was not a platform on the end of that ramp. Sorry. <laughs> uh, this is doing some very odd things. Hey, that plus one rank for my weapon made it. I have a green pick now. There we go. What the? I was wondering how to. I was wondering how you upgrade these things. Oh, there we go. That's how you. Blarg. Do it. Okay. I see what's happening so, here. We're okay. gonna be having a heat wave here in the next couple of days. I'm wondering to myself. What would it be like if I just showed up to my office at the height of the heat wave wearing Daisy Dukes? Uh... Mm -hmm. HR? Oops. Cut offs. HR. Yeah, probably. I think that they would be like... Um... Could this, you not? <laughs> <laughs> this violates a lot of things. Our Daisy Dukes oh, just, I can't like, help shorts with daisies they're, on them? No, no, they're, like, cut-off booty shorts. What? They have nothing to do no, with daisies. They they were bird. worn by a character named Daisy Duke from Dukes of Hazard. Yeah. Bird? Okay. What? You know, what should I wear? You know what you should wear. What should I wear? Uh, we're gonna just a sundress. <laughs> <laughs> Significantly less risque. Yes. Equally questionable. <laughs> Equally questionable? Yeah. God, I went to the store earlier today and I paid the price for wearing a t-shirt that was like slightly too heavy. 
I and can't like was just the miserable. Like you said, I was. No, no, you can't to. make it, but you can build the defenses. Around I need to it. track down like paper do thin, like a series of paper thin freaking uh, shirts to wear, because the temperature is out of control. Yeah. I'm just watching this building magically uh, construct itself. It's kind of cool itself. looking. Yeah, he wanted to make a super gazebo. Yeah. I was trying Fun. to help, and then I realized that I have no wood. <laughs> that I was have a problem. 989 wood, and I know oh, that... Oh, dude, um... can you drop it? <laughs> instead of Drop your wood for me, Instead Bert. of helping, can you just drop give it all to me? <laughs> your wood for me. I don't Good even know sir. how. And also... <laughs> just go to your inventory, go to the uh, Stop hammer trying to play anvil. your game, Bird. Just let me let us play the game for you. Well, no, okay. I, I need to upgrade inventory. his gazebo. He needs a maximum. He needs a maximum gazebo. Okay. Okay. Oh, you, have, you, have, you, have, you have the ability to upgrade? Hammer and yeah. anvil. Uh-huh. Uh, you guys should be able to get the ability to do so fairly soon. Uh, and then find wood. Okay, I found the wood. Now what do I do? And uh, it should say, like, X to drop or something. I see sort, drop, recycle, oh, I have, I have upgrade. inspect, equip, and back. Well, it would be drop, so just drop, drop maximum wood. Uh, sorry. Okay, I hit back. Unable to improve building. It is already perfect. Any kind of uh, traps we should be putting down around here? No. Nah, uh, we... How did I? How do I drop it again? <laughs> X bird. Just press the X key on your keyboard. Hey, hey! I'm not. I'm new to technology. Okay. I, is that I so? Don't need to be snippy with me. X getting snippy with it. <laughs> X is gonna get super snippy with you. <laughs> I paid for your for your college, you know. No, you what? didn't. <laughs> New really questions can't... being raised. I really can't tell if my character's lower legs are mechanical. Bert, or I have put more money I towards your college experience mechanical. than you have put towards mine. Because that's not enough. Uh, leg only for one cap. of the colleges. Still, counts. <laughs> only one of my colleges. I've been to four, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Four? It might, it oh might have god, even been you five. guys should upgrade your pickaxes. This is nice. Oh, it's you can so nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's on the uh, skill tree. You have to search for the pickaxe icon. Uh, yep. yep. I, I had well, a plus I have one rank. I gun, but I can't craft it. I, I hit the plus one rank, and now my pickaxe is a is green instead of gray. Like the quality can't background. Craft it. And that is nice. Oh shit! Is this a staircase? This is a staircase. Who did this? I'd I probably did this actually. What I are you talking about? I need grenades. The gazebo what is, is this? a crafting. Oh, I need blast powder, and for blast powder, I need to. I, it says made from coal. Yeah, do you, have can, any coal? You, you have to. Yeah. You, you can manually craft blast powder. Yeah. Okay. If you go to the hammer I don't, and anvil. Yeah, when I, to, when I told you there's like a weird custom crafting interface, that's one of the that's okay, one of like I'm the at, two or three things you can make yourself. Yeah, it's like one I'm of the blast two things. Powder, but I can't actually craft it, even though I have the ingredients for it. In, um, is your inventory full? Yes. Yep, that would do it. <laughs> I just had the exact same problem. I went up to it and it was full. I'm like, oh, <laughs> okay. That'll do it. Thank okay. you for your maximum wood bird. <laughs> Whoa, does that go to the top? Uh, the staircase? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Maximum gazebo. Maximum gazebo achieved. Does anyone have any coal they would like to give to the bird catcher foundation for the sure. interest of bird catcher? I can I dump so, so much coal on you, boy. For the purpose of bird catcher. Why don't yeah, you just the... salvage those, dude? You might um, actually pick them up, salvage them. You'll get blasting powder. Okay. Uh, how do I salvage them? You mean recycle? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's good I... to go through any mines you find. Not get any blasting powder, but maybe I can get some from these things. <laughs> 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 Nah. Oh, there's a bunch nah. of blasting powder. Okay, so I don't need anything. Right. We're talking when are we like gonna a, like start a character slaying from some zombies? The moon from, uh, Banjo Kazooie. Banjo Kazooie. I mean, 
Yeah. We can we can slay zombies. Uh, if if Bird wants to start us up, we can we can. I'm just gonna craft a gun because I haven't done that yet this entire game. Really? Yes. Huh. All right, good to go. Now, are we defending this or are we defending the main structure? Uh, both. Okay. All right, so I come over here and then I hit shield menu. And then what do I press? I see two buttons, expand shield and leave with party. Expand, expand shield. Expand shield. There's no... There's no reason to be impatient with me. I'm I'm trying to learn, so I yes, don't have to bother. No you reason this at anymore. all. Okay, expand shield. <laughs> shield power increasing. If you actually were technologically illiterate, Prepare I'd be patient with you. But your bird. What did you? What are you doing, Keith? <laughs> What's your bird? I'm attack improving. From the south. This, oh, it's this just is outside the barrier. That is not how you maximum gazebo. What the hell is it this? Now has a gazebo along we do reaching we are reaching points of hyper gazebo. They're coming. It's like when you're in church and there's weird little fucking pillars that stick down but don't reach the floor. And you're like, "What?" Uh, I think that's only a church to see you've been to with your yeah, weird California what weird style. What church purchase. did you go to? Yeah. yeah. You guys have never seen those like almost pillars before? Oh. No. No. Oh. California churches are weird. They are. No, I think I've only seen them in like movies and stuff. Like at how Shell is using the maximum gazebo as a sniping vantage point. Yeah. All right, we have to take it. Wait, why, why is there a railing on this staircase? I thought we were trying to get rid of it because it's uh, that it was like no, no, temporary. No, 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 no. You can no, you, you can. This way, you can get on top of the maximum gazebo. But it looks wrong. Yeah, it does. Oh, to he didn't uh, even he didn't late. even oh, and he didn't even upgrade it. I don't I don't have any wood left, man. You're an embarrassment. I gave you expensive. maximum wood. Yeah. Yeah, he gave you what? maximum Maxim wood, and this is how you repay him? I made him a maximum gazebo. I think that is fairly uh, <laughs> maximum reciprocity. <laughs> if I rest with the gazebo, I'll recover mana points. Have you guys all read that D&D &D story about the guy that didn't know what a gazebo was and thought it was a monster? Oh, yeah. Nope. It's magic. You should read it after you're done tonight. Uh, the gazebo is a monster in Munchkin. Yeah, it is, as a reference to this. It's, I think it's somebody in the Dread Gazebo or something like that. It's like the best story ever. Okay. You guys are taking the action it way is, too close to their it portals. Is, it is always way too tempting to throw a gazebo at you guys. As an enemy? Yeah. In the D&D campaign, just a sentient gazebo. <laughs> you had your yeah, chances, you sent, sentient you sent tables, tables and at barrels. us. Yeah, yeah. No, <laughs> you, you did not realize I'm laying the framework. You guys <laughs> you gotta, ever you find build yourselves up, you in a build garden, to, but where? You've got to build up to the Dread Gazebo and the, oh, yeah. uh, and the Oh No Necromancer. <laughs> well, first you guys got to see if you still have that druid in your bags. We have a break in <laughs> there... Mm -hmm. There better not ever be a Necromancer in the D&D campaign. <laughs> you already... There is, dude. There, yeah, he already was. You dumb. All right. Remember all the we remember all the undead people. <laughs> we didn't have to fight VV, but no. it still was an necromancer. Yeah. Somebody somebody had made a, a thread very early on in in Grave of Man, being like, "I feel like this hey. is all just a setup for Wander to get Bird to say, hey, oh, yes, cool? <laughs> oh yes, necromancer.' Oh yes, they were actually right. Wander, look. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow! <laughs> I need wood to make my bullets. That raises a lot of questions. It does. <laughs> I mean, what do you think you're uh, you're using to to? I mean, instead of gunpowder, the answer? Wood powder. Wood chips. Wood chips. Those are Best. not delicious sounding. No. <laughs> you want to chat out on some wood chips? Man. Having a legendary gun is awesome. I finished the last I mean, corner that Wander man. missed, but I can't make tier 3 upgrades. Yeah. You missed one of them corners. Oh, did I? Yep. So now there's like an unupgraded level 2 corner awkward thing there, because I put that in. Well, I mean, we'll be coming back here two more times, I was planning yeah. on. Yeah. That's when we covered, it, covered the entire thing with jump pads. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, we'll we'll put jump pads on instead of the staircases, and then you can get up onto the the. Uh... At this point, I'm just using all my shitty weapons to break them. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I've got some um, maxed out two star weapons, and I'm like trying to get rid of all all of my one stars. This is pretty first. chaotic with all the rain. <laughs> I used I used up my epic pistol yeah, and cool. a lot of, a lot of my legendary melee weapon, and I'm like, this is not worth using. Nope. Uh, especially once we get up to uh, chapter two, like Plankerton having one one star stuff is pointless. This is a really unique game. It is. I like it. I just kind of wish they'd like turn down the Skinner box for the uh, the paid period and de and design like a balanced like campaign. Yeah, thing it's also full of interesting so challenges. Painfully easy at this like the entire time we've been playing it. Yeah, so far we've never been given a reason to build anything. In a game about building stuff. I was I was actually looking every once in a while I'll, like look to see if I rank anywhere on like any of the pages for Fortnite. I think I'm on like page two or three or something like that. I don't know. Um, but in doing so, I more or less saw all of the uh, sponsored videos that people yeah. were, uh, were doing, yeah. and like. Where people hop in for one episode and they have super mega ultra gear and they just obliterate yeah, so the game and no one has to understand I anything. I saw a bunch of thumbnails specifically with the character that I play as, the ninja in the white outfit, because he's he's one of the like pre pre order pack yeah. characters. Yep. And yep. they're like thousand degree sword versus zombies, and it's just like I mean, it's just a sword. Not even interesting. Act. Hype, 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 hype. Picture of my I, face gasping and eye wide eyed. Whoa, what's up? It's a boy, Habanero in the ass gaming. Today we're gonna be playing Fortnite. Because everyone makes their thumbnails like they themselves are the I'm a fire in my laser like face. Yeah. <laughs> They're just like screaming in their thumbnail. I'm like, what are you screaming about? It's a fucking video game about grinding. <laughs> I felt weird making the thumbnail for my missed one because I'm like, I don't have like anything yeah, of me. She, she and then I'm have, like, oh wait, I have my missed maintainer it, suit. She doesn't have like, you know, uh, the, the cartoon the character. Keith. I don't yeah. have an avatar yet. She doesn't I have, have to the make one. Keith blank face or. No. I don't, I don't remember what she, she has, has cosplay. actually. Bird yeah, face. but she has cosplay. Bird angry face. I mean, on your channel. Cute. Bird smiley face on my channel. <laughs> I was in my maintainer suit, and I had a linking book, and I was pointing at it, going, "Yeah." Is there actually a different bird on your channel? Yes, because one's made by Wanderbot, and one's made by me. Oh, yep. I did not know that. All of the uh, branding on my channel, except for the thumbnails made by you, Keith, for the podcast, are done by myself. Hooray! I just I threw a lightning thing at nothing. <laughs> there, there's enemies. I should, get, I, I should get a copy of your version. Alive is the really low resolution one that Wander gave me for Battlebox Theater like 17 years ago. Oh, I mean, wow. I can give you the high res version of that. I've asked for it. <laughs> really? Yes. And you said, okay. Not. <laughs> and, and that was the end. <laughs> ask tonight, and you shall receive so much faster. I was making the PUBG thumbnails ravel over our heads. And I'm like, this is all I, I have. Whatever happened to the uh, intro animation that I made a long, long time ago? I used to think I thought that want, I thought that uh, Andrew's intro animation was so cool until I realized that that's literally the like the plug-in like stock one that that uh, mm. Adobe whatever does. I had a uh, animation I found it on somebody else's tween. channel with the exact animation but slightly <laughs> swapped colors. <laughs> I had a, wait, my wait, my intro animation um, was like it was super tweened, but it was still a lot of fun to make. It's of a bird hopping towards some seed. Uh, <laughs> underneath, like, one of those boxes with a stick holding yeah. it up. And then the stick gets pulled away, uh, and the box falls down, and it says, like, Bird Catcher Games on the side of the box. And then it opens uh. up to reveal, like, my logo and the name of the game. And then I made that, and then... Um, Never used it. I remember how proud you were of it. I used it a little bit, and then everyone was like, using intro videos is stupid, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, I remember when we used to have the like spinning uh, symbols or something for wanderers. Yeah, and then there was, and it was like, like fucking. Doo, 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 I was gonna say yeah, Firefly so started playing. <laughs> I, I, it wasn't Firefly. I, I got rid of it specifically because <laughs> I started hearing other people using that music. And I was just like, oh shit, oh, right? No. Yeah. Royalty free. Ten thousand fireflies. 
Yeah, it sounds like that. It was like boop 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 boop. Oh, when you said firefly, I thought you were talking about take me out into the black. No, no he's somebody like, actually no. recognized. Somebody no. in my chat is saying uh, they missed that video and I should use it again. <laughs> I am impressed that somebody ever saw it in the first place. <laughs> I'll never let I the internet forget like about Fairy Solitaire. Nice. Well, I mean, uh, to be to be fair, if they're looking for your solo content, it might be a little bit easier to find. I have a re yeah, I, start from I, the very beginning. I, I have like a 200 episode uh, recommendations playlist now, and it features one Let's Play video, which is Fairy Solitaire by Birdcatcher. <laughs> <laughs> I've noticed it. I was like, why am I in your recommendations playlist? <laughs> never forget. I feel like. If we ever become fans with like a bunch of other big YouTubers, or fans, friends, uh, with a bunch of other big YouTubers, I feel like we should all like, um, as like a whole kind of do kind of one shitty thing of like shout out videos where we all try and like hype up kind of the worst content from each other. Oh, like, uh, oh. <laughs> like oh. You, you dig up the darkest secret of each channel. No, 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 no. Like, very solitaire for Bird. I don't know what with me. But that's good uh, content from Bird. <laughs> well, yeah, but it's like, his best it's solo that... video ever made. Well, it's the best solo video anybody's ever made. Are you kidding <laughs> yeah, me? Yeah, exactly. It's... So, uh, your the seven-minute video, video of me earlier, pretending Keith. to be a middle school girl. <laughs> <laughs> like Keith, you know that video you sent me earlier today, right? Yeah. If. We could get that up to a million views, I would be so happy. I would be happy to have a million views on any video I've ever made. That's a bad example. My most video viewed video I've ever been involved with was when Andrew made an Incredible Hulk and a character creator, and it got like 400,000 views. What? Character creator videos do weirdly well for some reason. They do great. I mean, if you are if you tag it with like a specific character that's also, popular Also, the thumbnail was his, pixel, yeah. his pixeled out naked penis area. Oh. Because you can just take the pants off of your characters and Saints Must Row. Uh, Saints Must Row. Saints Must Row. That's probably what people, what they were Saints to Must Row. <laughs> oh my god. Now people are quoting Fairy Solitaire in my chat. X. Yeah, I, I, love, I love Fairy Mari. Solitaire. It's in the X. territory. For me, it's, it, it, for me, I rank it like w up there with like when Andrew and I played fucking Secret of the Magic Crystals. <laughs> now that I think about it, I'm gonna pin that dumb video of yours, Keith, in my announcements, <laughs> and no one will understand why. Nope. Some people might. That took a long time. Well, I mean, I had to make the dread gazebo, so go figure. Yeah. It took, it took a yeah. while. It's important right. for lore reasons. Yep. All right, Shell, I'm sending you an invite. I'm still loading back in, apparently. Yep. It I have to. Slow. I have to pull some some levers on my Skinner boxes real quick, then we'll play. Yeah, it's understandable. I just got a crap ton of rewards for doing that mission, of course. They see me loading and Lo loading. I just want to get my first mythic, uh, like my first mythic reward ever from a mini reward llama. <laughs> Just like against all odds. I bet it's probably not even programmed for that to be a possibility. I can't imagine it is. Oh Ooh, god, I, got too I, many just I just remembered the pun in the video you were talking about <laughs> that I love so much. Oh no. Because you could play as the Hojo clan in, uh. You can play as the Hojo clan in Samurai Wars 4, which I believe, if I remember correctly, I think those might be the people that have, like, the famous, like, Triforce insignia as their clan symbol. Like, before that was ever, like, a Zelda thing. Uh, but I named my character Hojo Jojo. <laughs> <laughs> so, I don't know if Metal was paying attention earlier, but he just popped into my chat to say, what the hell did I just watch on Discord? <laughs> <laughs> That's a short video. Perfect, yeah. It is a short video. I'd watch it on stream, but I'm not entirely sure if it would work out well. Yeah, I don't know if you saw it, Bird, but you know the where we were looking at for the weird out-of-date interface stuff? Right next to that is an upgrade pickaxe symbol. I don't know oh, if there's okay. any other- I don't know if there's another one anywhere else in the tree. It's, pr it's probably on the way to the next tree on each tree. So it's under the skill tree you can upgrade it? Yeah, it's on the skill tree. It's 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 only two bips Upgrade away from. Axe. Oh, I I have yeah. that. I can just do it right now. Yeah, it's two bips away from the tier two like branch. 
and then that makes your pickaxe a green quality weapon instead of a gold. I mean, instead of a instead of a gray. Which I think just makes all harvesting better forever, which is probably a big deal. I need to get the quest van or astro van before I can continue forward. Yeah, that is the end of chap chapter one. Yep, that unlocks skill tree number two, apparently. Yes.